What is safety stock? We can define safety stock as inventory that is kept as a buffer against mismatch between forecasted and actual consumption, between expected and actual delivery time, and for unforeseen emergencies. Inventory kept in an enterprise usually depends on the demand of the items and the time it takes to procure those items. These factors, however, are subject to uncertainty because demand can vary due to unexpected or unforeseen customer behavior, or perhaps the lead time varies because of unplanned interruptions. These variabilities need to be buffered by ways of safety stock. The decision on what level of safety stock is kept is more or less equivalent to making a trade-off between cost of inventory versus cost of stock outs, always under the shadow of uncertainties that you must deal with. If you decide to keep safety stock and therefore higher inventory, the probability of a stock out and therefore any costs associated with it is low and vice versa. It depends on the accuracy of the demand forecast and the length of the replenishment lead time as well as the defined service level. From a planning perspective, when using a static safety stock, this safety stock quantity reduces the quantity that is available in MRP, meaning in the net requirements calculation, safety stock is not used to cover requirements as can be seen in this example. Of course, the physical stock can still be used to satisfy demands, and safety stock generally does not exist as a specific physical unit or stock type, nor is it physically kept in a separate location. It really just exists in the system to be used in material requirements planning.